another day, another video. Today we are looking at brakes. So the plan is to get these stripped down um, in terms of all the paint off so I can give them a lick of paint. Um, these are AP Racing 4 put calipers. I think the model number is CP5200. Uh, they're off a Mark III Golf VR um, and they come with 330mm by 28mm discs. Um, so they're a reasonably good kit. Quite old now, they've been superseded now with a new caliper, but they do work. So I've just got to get the piston seals and some f few bits and pieces just to give them a bit of a refurb. But other than that, they should be golden. So um, they were black, they were painted black, not very well. Um, so I've started to strip off as much of that black paint as I can. I did use some nitromol previously. It shifted some of it, but not quite all of it. So what I'm going to do is just agitate as much of this paint as I can with a wire brush and then I'm going to try some of this spray on paint stripper and see if that budges the rest of it and then I'll stick it in the blast cabinet and uh, finish it off with that. So I'll be using some uh, glass bead to kind of clean it off. It's a slow process um, and it, it's not as harsh and abrasive as like, steel beads but it shouldn't impregnate it with those kind of that gritty steel kind of dirt that you can get. So what I'm going to do now is just again agitate it with a steel um, wire wheel and then um, I'll give it a lick of uh, paint stripper. Right, I've gone over them with a wire brush. Um, doesn't seem like it's made much difference, but it has kind of started to bite in some of the paint. So uh, let's see what the uh, paint jibber can do from this point. Okay, just put the second coat on. The first coat did quite a good job actually getting most of it off. So I just wire brushed it and then gave it a second coat just to get the last few little bits off and I think we should be good. I'll let that dry for 15 minutes and then I'll come back. Okay, so I've wiped them clean now. There's still some few bits which need a bit more attention on the back but that's more corrosion than it is paint so um, the wire wheel should get most of that off if not the Dremel um, but the faces look cool I reckon the um, sandblast will get those spotless so yeah what I'm going to do now is get the sandblaster out and uh, put these in and give them a blast okay I've got the uh, cabinet out there's already some blast media in there and I've got my uh, first half of my caliper to do. There you have it. Not too bad. Missed a few spots, but I think I need to agitate those bits a bit more. And you can see the uh, corrosion, especially on these inside edges where the wear plates go. Um, that needs a bit more attention. But other than that, it's looking quite good. Yeah, happy with that. And the good thing about using um, glass beads is they are clean. Anyway, I'm happy with that. So what I'm going to do is finish off the last of them and then I'll show you a, a shot of all the calipers all cleaned up. Okay, all done now. All the calipers are blasted. I've also given the, the mounting brackets a clean 
and the crossover pipes, mounting bolts and the wear plates. Also given the braided lines a bit of a clean, so they're all nice and neat. So I've literally just got off the phone with um, Questmead, who is the company that I'm getting the seals and a few replacement pistons and stuff from. So I think they've got all the bits in stock, so I'll place them later today. So once they arrive, I should be able to put all this back together again. Um, and we should be good. Um, I think the discs are okay. They're a little bit rusty, but I don't think they're heavily pitted. I'm not sure if you can quite see through there. So we'll give them a whirl and see how they are. I might give the bells a bit of a clean up, but um, other than that, we'll see how they are. If I'm getting any vibration or what have you, then I'll get some new discs, but for now, I'll give them a try. But anyway, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll catch up on the next update. Cheers, bye.